One thing's for sure, I'm never short of surprises and fuzzy little guys are normally never a shock anymore. This was my third time back to this residence so I knew exactly what I was dealing with. I bought some big live traps to bring with me and I'm gonna return in a few days to set anything we catch free. Honestly, this cleaning was so satisfying but also heartbreaking to know that this poor family were living in conditions like these. The cupboards were clearly a breeding ground for these little fuzzy dudes and were completely unusable for years. When you're not in a good season of life and experiencing poor mental health, it's extremely hard to take care of yourself, let alone the environment around you. It builds up easily and can get to the point of no return like this. It's so difficult for people to know where or how to start, let alone to get the motivation to do it. Dream cases like this where I witness years worth of mosi droppings absolutely breaks my heart because no one wants to live like this. And as you can see, I even had some live little guys pop out at me quite a few times. I did actually manage to catch and release a few of them and then I set some more live traps to see if I could get any more. After removing all of the items and their main bedding area, I was left with cupboards full of the most amount of tinkles and droppings I've ever 